Hello everyone, my name is Chris Lessart and welcome to the Overwatch Contender Season 1 Europe Recap Show. Stay tuned for the top 5 plays, but for now, let's get straight to the games. Our first match for Week 2 was 1-2-3 versus Bazooka Puppies. 1-2-3 got a quick 2-0 on Oasis, where Finzi's McCree got a surprising fan the hammer kill in 2017. With the fan the hammer, Psycho Waffle will fall. King's Row was much closer as both teams completed the map and sent it to a tiebreaker. Bazooka Puppies only got the payload halfway due to this missed Graviton Dragon Strike combo. Only gets Denia though, it's not a super high value grab. Oh. Snilla wreaks havoc into the back line. A disaster for the Bazooka Puppies. 1-2-3 sees the opening with this thrilling team kill that secured their second map win. Two minutes left for 1-2-3, but those two minutes might be two centuries to the Bazooka Puppies. Hanamura hosted a 1-2-3 domination with Finzi shutting down Ube, then flanking point B for a very quick map completion. Look at the position from Finzi. He recognizes they're going to be pushing on for the point. There's no reason for him to be on that. Bazooka Puppies didn't get to see point B, but they did see the bottom of the map thanks to Tonic. And this is a disaster for the Bazooka Puppies right now. They had to take that fight, and yet, one, two, three, hold strong. Watchpoint Gibraltar continued Finzi's dominating match momentum along with some great Widowmaker headshots by Kenzie. And with that pickoff, Bazooka Puppies opening the way. The map went to a tiebreaker, but one, two, three had more time on the clock and secured a definitive 4-0 sweep. Yeah, that will indeed be it, ZP. They're going to be the winners here of map number four. A very convincing fashion here for one, two, three. Next up was Singularity versus Gamers Origin. After a 100-0 Gamers Origin stomp on Control Center, Garden hosted a much closer fight. Lee Sphera wasn't getting the job done, so a mid-round switch to Doomfist helped Gamers Origin take Lee Zhang Tower 2 to zero. Again, another rising uppercut. Lee stuck with Doomfist on Noombani, which helped Gamers Origin complete the map with time to spare. Singularity struggled on point A as Leaf's oppressive Doomfist smashed any hope of a point capture, securing another map win for Gamer's Origin. Overtime will fall, and Gamer's Origin, what a hold, what a play. An early Widow pick from Hardest earned Gamer's Origin a quick point A on Hanamura. Already a two-man advantage. Then Leaf's Doomfist once again ripped apart Singularity to secure point B with excess time. Singularity captured a swift point A, but couldn't overcome Leaf's Doomfist and Hardest McCree on point B. He's got a great Ooh. opportunity for a Dead Eye. That is beautiful. Dead Eye setup is fantastic as well. Forces the positioning, picks up the kill. Danny gets demented and another push dead in the water. Dorado hosted more Gamers Origin domination, where they stopped Singularity before the first checkpoint, then turned around for another Gamers Origin map win, earning a conclusive 4 0 sweep. Leaf just making absolute destruction all over it, painting a pretty picture in. Indeed, the kill feed is filled with blue, and Gamer's Origin will be the winners of map number four. Up next was E United versus Cloud9. Cloud9 Sinatra blasted out of the gates, handing out pulse bombs like business cards to help win Lijong Tower 2 0. Sinatra in the back! Found Boombox! Both teams pushed the payload to the end of Nubani, but E United had less time and couldn't get point A in the tiebreaker. Cruz using his Dragon Blade to see if he can get absolutely anything here, but the players of E United, they're all dead. Sinatra created an opening with these flank kills on E United supports, but Cruz went nuclear, nearly halting Cloud9. Cruz, what is this man? He's just going back in. I don't believe what I've just seen. Nemix, he gets the switch strike. It's a 1v1 Valentine versus Nemix. He's so weak. Nemix was there. Oh my goodness, man. What is that? Volskaya hosted our first draw. Oh, but not wow. going to happen. Shut down by Unfixed here in overtime. Yeah. Where both teams got thrilling point B captures in overtime. He can't die early like that. He oh, opened the door goodness. for C9. E United were able to get a map win on Watchpoint Gibraltar with a solid last point defense. Most Zaza tries to just stagger it out as long as he possibly can. Cloud9 walked away with a 3-2 series victory. Our next match was Misfits versus Team Gaganti. Shrine and Sanctum were back and forth for both teams. The entire kill feed is filled with blue. Despite this Linkser Dragon Blade, he wants to move in. The Dragon Blade is active, and he picks up the kill onto Vic. Misfits took Nepal 2 0. They need to initiate in. They didn't get on the point. King's Row was a close fight, with both teams finishing the map with help from Linkser's Hanzo. He's searching for the Scatter Arrow. He finds it. And to Vic's Doomfist. 
Big Goose has been the victim of this fist over and over again, and the Misfits, they crush Giganti. But this Logics and Manitid Big Bang shut down Giganti's hopes in the tiebreaker as Misfits took another map win. Logics, you absolute nutter! 4K off the bust, and that will be that! After Team Giganti overcame a tough Misfits defense to complete Volskaya in overtime, Misfits countered with a speedy point B capture thanks to this Tavik Nanoblade that not even Sombra could avoid. Turning this into his own personal house of horrors, a triple kill for Tavik. And this is looking awfully easy right now for the Misfits. Misfits continued their domination on Dorado, stopping Giganti on defense, then completing the map with time to spare on offense. Everything going the way of Misfits to Vic's Blade, sated at the very end. Misfits swept Team Giganti 4 0. Now, let's take a look at the standings. Misfits, Gamers Origin, and 1 2 3 are tied for 1 2 and 3 at the top, while Team Giganti and Cloud9 are right behind them. And now it's time for Europe's top five plays from week two. Kicking off the countdown at number five, it's Mr. Clean. We've seen our fair share of missed pulse bombs which is what made the squeaky clean double kill stick by Volatalia look like poetry in motion. Volatalia commits the pulse bomb, it's a big one! At number four, it's never skip leg day. Finzi's fully powered Zarya didn't let a Reinhardt shield get in the way of this Graviton surge, opting to double jump off the payload and cleaning up the mess personally. Finzi, <laughs> he's his own follow through, bruh. That is stylish indeed. Coming in at number three, it's Access D9. Team Giganti hoped for an overtime push in this King's Row tiebreaker, but Manitin's well-placed Graviton set up Logix for this game-ending pulse bomb halfway through the arch. Both the days! Logix, you absolute nutter! 4K off the bust, and that will be that! Our number two play is Hide and Seek. Misfits captured Volskaya in record time thanks to this Tavik Nanoblade. Sombra attempted to translocate away, but couldn't hide from Tavik's rampage. A triple kill for Tavik! And this is looking awfully easy right now for the Misfits. And our number one play is too close for comfort. Cloud9 Sinatra flanked point A for two quick kills in this Numbani tiebreaker, but Cruz put forth a valiant comeback that cleared out every member of Cloud9, except for Nevix, who ended the impressive comeback with a deflect on Cruz and a well-placed shuriken on Volatalia. Absolutely, it is all crumbling now around the United. Already about 20%. But Cruz, what is this man? He's just going back in. I don't believe what I've just seen. Nevix, he gets the switch strike. It's a 1v1 Valentaja versus Nevix. He's so weak. Nevix was it. Oh my goodness, man. What is that? Get out of here, Cloud9. Get out. Thank you for watching the Overwatch Contenders Season 1 Europe Recap Show. Be sure to check out overwatchcontenders.com for all of the up to date tournament information. And now, your European Boop of the Week. And this is a disaster for the Bazooka Puppies right now. They had to take that fight.